Prince Philip is spending lockdown with the Queen at Windsor Castle. This is the one royal who stepped into the Duke of Edinburgh's shoes following his retirement. Prince Philip, 98, served the crown for 65 years before retiring from royal life in 2017. As well as being a source of invaluable support to his wife Queen Elizabeth II, 93, the Duke of Edinburgh set up hundreds of charitable initiatives which continue to do great work to this day. One of Prince Philip's most recognized achievements was establishing the Duke of Edinburgh Dove, award scheme which encourages young people to become involved in their communities and to develop essential skills for life and work. The award scheme has three tiers, bronze, silver and gold and every year thousands of 14 to 24 year olds achieve one of these levels. This year the coronavirus pandemic means the award ceremony for those receiving their gold award could not go ahead as planned. However, Prince Philip's youngest son Prince Edward, 56, stepped up on social media to congratulate those who had achieved the gold tier. The royal family Twitter account shared a clip of Prince Edward congratulating DOF achievers. The tweet read, Congratulations to the 12,468 incredible young people who have achieved their Adolf Gold Award in the last year. Although the official award ceremonies couldn't go ahead this spring, we hope you take a moment to celebrate. The Earl of Wessex sends a message to you all. In his message Prince Edward said he was really heartened by the fantastic stories he'd heard about participants working to make a difference during the current crisis. Prince Edward added, I know that lots of you are out there using your volunteering skills and life experiences to contribute to efforts in your local communities, especially supporting the vulnerable and the isolated. Thank you so much. I hope this collection of films will help boost your morale and show you how much people admire your resilience, as well as giving you just a little insight into that band of gold award holders that you have just become a part of. For the virtual award ceremony Prince Edward enlisted the help of celebrities including Marvine Humes and Strictly Come Dancing stars, Jeanette Marara and Al Jaskar J. Neck. The self-isolating stars wished gold award holders congratulations for their achievements. Prince Edward and his wife Sophie, Countess of Wessex have kept an active presence of social media amid the coronavirus lockdown. They recently shared a clip of themselves clapping for the NHS with their two children Lady Louise Windsor, 16, and Viscount James Severn, 12. The family live in Surrey at Bagshot Park and last week Sophie went to extraordinary lengths to help the local community. She donned protective latex gloves and a mask to help out at local Surrey Heath homeless charity The Hope Hub. The Hope Hub works to prevent and end homelessness in Surrey Heath and the surrounding areas and during her surprise visit the Countess helped pack and deliver Easter food parcels for homeless and vulnerable people in emergency accommodation in Surrey Heath. She was photographed wearing latex gloves and a surgical mask to stay protected during the engagement and carrying out tasks at a safe distance from other volunteers. The extraordinary visit was tweeted about by Surrey Health Council. The local authority posted on Twitter, it was a joy to welcome HRH the Countess of Wessex on Thursday 9th of April to FA Hip Hub to meet staff and volunteers and help pack emergency food parcels for vulnerable clients who are in temporary accommodation during COVID-19 and would otherwise be homeless, Chief Exec Megs Mercer, 